Hello everyone, welcome to HE Engineering. Today I am going to discuss you about the tips for designing front elevation of the building. Friends, uh, the front elevation design of our home holds great importance in the architecture of your building. These are not only making the building, ma making our building visually appealing, but also enhances its uh, environmental and commercial value. And it is also first impression of your building to the people who visits. Without any further delay, let's start our video. Then first is tip number one to make elevation drawing along with the plan is the first tip. It is our normal practice that first we will make plan and uh, and we will start the building work with respect to the approved plan. Uh, but after the com uh, but after completion of the structural work, we used to think the elevation design. At that time, we can have better elevation design, but not the best because we cannot make changes in the structural uh, members of your building like if you want to make some uh, pro uh, projection or uh, uh, if you want to have some uh, cantilever uh, uh, projection or any additions which could have to be done during the structural work itself but now it is too late for uh, uh, to maintain in the projections uh, so it is very important to make elevation designs before commencement of the building then we can talk about tip number two keeping in view the drainage and uh, water issue while planning the elevation design of your building the entry of rainwater inside the building remains a main common problem experienced in the most poorly designed buildings so we have to pl plan well to avoid this issue and also we we should not provide rainwater pipeline at the elevation of the building and uh, next is uh, if we, if you are providing chaja then we should have uh, then we have to maintain proper slope so that to uh, to uh, to rainwater should uh, drain out immediately and and due to the rainwater seepage rain, the chacha reinforcement should not be uh, should not get rusted in future then we can talk about tip number 3 tip number 3 is about allowing a natural light to come inside your building through the exterior house of a uh, housing elevation of design that is, uh, it will cut down the maintenance cost in the long run. The most convenient way is to plan the front elevation design in such a manner that it allows the entry of natural light inside your building. And moreover, it's cut down the energy cost by at least 30%. Thus, contributing to uh, that, it, it will contribute to the uh, greener environment. Then, tip number four. Tip number four is about elevation. Should uh, elevation material should be of a low maintenance cost. That is, we have to make uh, we have to make use of friendly materials so that in future, if elevation material gets rusted or uh, it gets any fault, then it can be attended by local labor itself. It is not like a special technician should come from company to repair or uh, replace the material, and uh, it will also uh, it can make you spend more money for. Uh, hiring a, a special technician from the company then we can talk about tip number five use contrast the to make front elevation design interesting uh, to relieve the boredom in the elevation design of your house for the use of contrast should be made however it must be ascertained that contrast does not mess with the overall balance of exterior house of elevation design the safest way is uh, to use contrast is uh, first uh, is uh, solid versus and uh, wide and then uh, opaque versus uh, transparent uh, we can use uh, smooth texture versus uh, rough texture and uh, also we can use uh, light and dark uh, colors then we can talk about safe tip 6 material should be in safety Elevation or cladding material which are going to be used in the in your building should not be overweight or in a big size like uh, stone tiles etc so that it may it may hurt to someone in later period if at all you are going to use the heavy material then you must consult your structural engineer before fixing of your material then we can talk about uh, tip number 7 getting designs from google images can be a wrong practice 
most of the client used to download images from Google and used to adopt the same design and uh, this might be a uh, wrong practice because architects or experts used to design elevation building with respect to the building condition its orientation and uh, depend upon the facing of the building whether it is north or south or uh, east or west for example if it is south facing building uh, using a heat reflecting material or if uh, sun heat uh, directly uh, coming inside the building then we have to add some uh, filters like mesh etc to reduce the temperature inside the house so researching the elevation design is good idea to uh, to get a good idea but uh, following the complete design might not be good instead we can hire a expert like architect or civil engineer for uh, designing the elevation of the building then we can talk about tip number 8 most of the client used to think that all high quality visualization of uh, your uh, elevation design are good and less visuals uh, design are not good enough this is a wrong concept because sometimes expert like architect or designer does not care about producing high quality visuals but their concepts and their designs will be extraordinary and sometimes less experienced designer and even a fresher with less knowledge can produce high quality visuals but their design concept might not be up to the level so high visuals are not that much important as like design then we can talk about tip number nine privacy is more important for maintaining uh, for maintaining privacy uh, we can have cnc cutting jolly or uh, sand blasted glass for balconies or for uh, opening nowadays uh, wc panels with uh, cnc cutting gives more uh, gives your front elevation of your house or uh, a natural and uh, effortless look as a result this is the one of the best product to be used as a exterior grade material they have they also have uh, high impact and tensile strength and uh, next final point is a tip number 10 that is budget budget is also an important factor in the uh, in the elevation of the building for designing the elevation of the building because it is an understanding that uh, costliest elevation material gives best elevation look which might not be correct but with the less expensive material and uh, with the good designer and uh, it's a good design also we can get the elegant, elegant uh, elevation design that's all for today's video hope this video is informative to you if you like this video please share it with your friends and family members thank you khuda hafiz